Hey guys, it's me Zell, and we are here with another episode of The Bad Batch. Episode 13 of season 2, and it's called Pabu. Pabu. Like Babu, maybe? Probably not. Um, but our last episode was really intense. Um, again, deep, good story for Crosshair. So the tide may be turning in our favor for the whole original team plus friends to reconnect. We don't know yet what's in store. Um, Crosshair's obviously in trouble with the Empire after, you know, outsting, killing, murdering a officer, commander. I forgot what position. Anyways, a supervisor, a boss man. He killed him right in front and he was surrounded and they didn't seem to be much sympathetic. So we'll see what's in store for Crosshair. Probably gonna be in some sort of jail. And then, Last we saw with the Bad Batch crew is they were going to meet up with Rexy and Echo for this other mission. So I don't know, guess we'll, we could see them both together or something else, but I'm excited. Hope you are too. So let's get to it. The Bad Batch episode 13, Pabu. Is this the city that Obi-Wan was in? Or Andor. Andor. Both? Well, Crowder, city. are we gonna sit here all day or can we get to business? Ooh. <laughs> Payment first. It is really cool. Not until I know it's not one of your two bit knock. Like we have a deal. Wow. Can't drink through your masks. I don't know. Poison is not typically my drink. Oh, now they're gonna get poisoned a different She's not way. A pirate. She's a liberator of ancient wonders. Oh my that gosh. I am. <laughs> uh oh. <gasps> ah! That's the same creatures that Anakin had against him. New pet? Bro. Oh, we did. She did. <laughs> now it's getting interesting. Very cool. I like this whole. Oh! That was a Han Solo kind of move. Oh my goodness. You wouldn't shoot a child. Oh. Yes, I am playing against myself. It is the only time this game is a challenge. Oh my gosh. We need a pickup. Wow. But don't you think she should learn some other skills? What other skills? Look at him getting a little bit more protective. With you three. She needs friends. Ooh, that's pretty. Wow. Look how peaceful it looks. Welcome to Pabu, my home Pabu. away from home. It's a hidden sanctuary. There's treasures from all over the galaxy. My analysis wow. indicates that this so-called artifact you recovered is of very little to no monetary value. Treasure can mean many things. Hmm. Most of the villagers on Pabu are refugees. Many of the items I recover are remnants of their cultures, and that's worth preserving. Aww. After all, I am a liberator, liberator of ancient wonders. It's about time you showed your face around here. Miss me, Shep? You got some competition. <laughs> Auntie what? V! What'd you bring this time? A friend! Welcome. Oh. Welcome. Welcome. And further! <laughs> 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 Oh. Friends here before. Beautiful. Wow. That's pretty, but also terrifying. That's so cool. Wait till you see it up close. That's so pretty. So they just built that over the years? Is it? I have not heard her laugh like that in some time. Oh. Some come to Pabu looking for a clean slate, a chance to start over. Oh. As a father, you couldn't ask for a better place to raise a child. 
Do you think they talk, or is he just guessing? Something to think about, isn't it? You're suggesting we all stay on Pabu permanently. <laughs> That's just a taste. <laughs> she seems to like it here. A little stability. Oh, that's so nice of her to offer that. Wow. I'm full. I am never full. Wow. I will note the date and time to commemorate such a momentous occasion. <laughs> yep. Oh my gosh, Tech. There's more? <laughs> Hope you saved room for dessert. I love this place. Oh, everyone has their own pleasantries. There's gotta be not even big creatures. The Empire. I'm so sorry. But you're safe here. You and your friends can stay as long as you want. We never stay They're anywhere so for nice. long. Never? Doesn't that get lonely? I never really thought about it. Oh, Wrecker's it's so pleasant. Almost time. For what? See for yourself. Oh, now Tech gets something he likes. Everyone's having a thing that they enjoy. Pretty spectacular, right? I suppose that is one way to quantify it. She's helping him. Just to kind of take a step back and enjoy and appreciate the little things. It's quiet. Too quiet. Something's coming. We need to. They just got there. What was it? Whoa, is that going to be an active volcano? It's no big deal. Happens all the time. I think that's a volcano. Or something. I don't think it's over yet. Why does the chaos happen when they show up? The early warning system would have activated. I don't like the sound of that. Is it tsunami? Is that what they're talking about? Gosh, that's terrifying. That would, oh my gosh, the arm strength. That'd be so tiring. But you need everything that you can. This is the last one. Bro! And can I help you? Everything will be fine, Mr. Hinton. Oh! No, what is it happening? I see you. Grab the log. Oh my gosh. Oh my, why? to start over based on my estimations it will take several rotations to rebuild the damage sustained in lower pabu yes why am i shipping Pabu's them now destroyed but my people are resilient oh they're gonna stay they're gonna help rebuild they're gonna have relationships they're gonna have friends they're gonna have homes That was a good episode. I love that they won. That Fee was like comfortable enough to show not just a place she knew of, but like her home where she calls where she calls home and it's comfortable and safe to her. 
And she brought these guys. She trusts them. She likes them. And she cares about them. She cares about Omega. And inter even introduced it to her niece or, you know, her presumed niece. So I love that. I love that she's comfortable with that. And she wants what's best for them in a happy, good place. And, you know, obviously you were sensing, like, it couldn't just be an episode of just good feelings. Like, there was, there's got to be something bad that was going to happen or something. But it wasn't like the usual. It was like a natural disaster, right? Yeah, of course, like, the natural disaster that hasn't happened in three centuries or whatever happened on the day they happened to be there. Um, what are the odds? <laughs> but the good news about it is, since it happened now... Now it'll be a really long time until the next one happens, hopefully. So, or maybe they'll come up with another plan of where to position all these refugees and yada yada. So didn't expect it, but it totally feels like there's a vibe going between Tech and Fee. Like he kind of glances at her. She's kind of showing him these lights, you know, checking in with him and kind of teasing a little bit. And even Tech's like glancing her way and, and I'm shipping it. I don't know, but there's something there. <laughs> and I really like that. It's really cute, especially it being Tech, like someone that seems like totally not interested outside of like his 1v1 games which might even be like then foreshadowing he's like oh that's the only challenge is me playing with playing against myself right so i don't know and wrecker then they're hinting at he you know had his buddy with the mayor and then you know all the good food you know he's easy to easy to please um and of course Omega with uh, the different friends and I feel like Hunter and Omega's relationship is the closest of the group. Um, it's really really cute to see that and I'm excited to see what's in store and again I wasn't expecting it. I was expecting them to go on this mission and maybe they connected um, they're gonna connect in the future or maybe they were I don't think they would suggest they were connect without us knowing but either way really fun. Um, so curious to see if they're gonna show us more of that so um, anyways, <laughs> thanks for being here. Sorry if you guys heard barking or me looking more distracted. I had my dog, Calcifer, whose six-month-old Corgi was next to me. It was attempting and thought he would nap, but then he, there was distractions around, so didn't work out as planned quite as much as I'd hoped. But that's the way life is, so thanks for being here and thanks for watching and supporting. Um, I appreciate you guys who are still here, even with the bumps in the rows um and the interruptions and scheduling and and all the changes and uh those who are around or watching this now hey i see you and i appreciate you so um if you want to show continued support go ahead and give an upvote for the video and uh and if you're new here or you happen to always see wing by and you're not already subscribed go ahead and push that subscribe button i really appreciate it um, and not just me, but my editor, um, for those who aren't aware, Sons of Sun, um, a friend of mine um, from day one has been editing all these videos, majority of these videos on this channel, all the good quality edits are him. So all thanks goes to him and appreciation. So all the support um, means the world to us. So um, this is a, you know, a hobby and a side, um, side gig thing for us. So yeah it's it's fun we en i enjoy it you know he enjoys it too so anyways on that note i'll stop rambling and i'll see you on the next one